Because it's so important for us to be able to learn, our brains are made with incredible redundancy. We don't just have one neuron doing one thing. It's a massive network. It's a forest, not a tree. And that forest has redundancy. So you can go to a forest and cut down a bunch of trees and the forest just whoop, pops right back, is able to do all the things a forest does until you cut down too many trees. And now it ceases to become a forest. It starts to become a grassland with a few trees. And that's an entirely different ecosystem that has intensely different capabilities that are there. There is a transition that happens when one loses the redundancy of the extra trees in the forest, the extra neurons in the brain. We see this in Parkinson's very clearly. The areas of the brain that are damaged in Parkinson's, we may end up losing 70 to 80% of those neurons in the substantia nigra before we have the first tremor start to happen. So that means some estimates are 90% of those original neurons are gone before we get our first symptom. This is why focusing on symptoms is incredibly late stage. If you have a symptom of cognitive decline, I consider that a late stage problem. We are no longer in early stage anything if you are having decline.